Hey there, in this video, I'm gonna show you two awesome warm up exercises that you can do with your horse. I am teaching my student Sylvia on Mercurio, and I'm gonna show you the leg yield at the walk and the three loop serpentine. These are two really great exercises to get your horse on the aids in the warm up. This is only Sylvia's third time riding Mercurio, and I think she does a really good job. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the bell. If you like my videos, I post a new video every single Wednesday. Also check out in the description box below. I have a great free PDF for you to download to help you with your rider position. So without further ado, let's get started with the video. All right, hello, I'm Amelia. This is Sylvia. She has um, volunteered to be our demo rider today. You've ridden Mercurio, what, this is your third time in like three years. So she rode him once a few years ago and then earlier this week. So we're just gonna go through the basics because that's always the most important thing when you're riding a horse that you are just getting to know is every horse is really different. He's a lot different than the horse that she's used to riding. So we're just gonna go through the basics and see how far we get. And fun fact about Sylvia, she does a lot of these video editing for us. So all of the cool effects on the videos, that's all Sylvia's work. Ready? Yep. Okay, go Mercurio. When you get down there to see, you're just gonna turn up the center line and then you're gonna ride a leg yield at the walk. So just go ahead and he's a little bit tricky with the contact because I'm sure you feel how he kind of wants to be either above or behind the contact. So focus on getting him connected from the right leg to the left hand. Half halt, left rein, and leg yield. Press with your right leg, half halt the left rein. Press with your right leg, keep your left leg quieter. So I should see your right leg doing something and your left leg quieter. Good. Good. Half halt, over. Half halt, good, good. Yeah, that's right. That was really good. Do it one more time. So you're gonna turn up the center line and you're gonna ride a leg yield off your right leg. Levi, get out of the way. Good, turn a little sooner so that you really look up and look for a C like there's a jump at X. Plan ahead. Good, good. So what you wanna feel in the leg yield is the right hind connecting to the left rein. Don't let him curl, that's right. Good, so the leg yield can be a really good exercise for a horse that wants to curl. Yep, connecting him in the left rein. Now he needs to be a little rounder. Yeah, so you feel how he curls and then he goes above the bit and your job when you're doing the leg yield is you wanna focus on getting him perfectly steady in the connection. Next time, turn up the center line and then leg yield off of your left leg this time. So you're gonna turn up the center line, you're gonna change the left leg, and then you're gonna leg yield him to the right. That's right, so turning, good. Flex him slightly to the left, but don't let him dive down. Keep his left ear up, yep. Let the shoulders go a bit more by opening your right rein. Good. Half halt, over. Get there before V. Half halt, put your left leg a little more forward. Supple and give on the left. There. Good, good. Yeah, that's right. Good, one more time off your left leg. That side's a little harder, right? So if he's not listening to your left leg, be a little more like give him a little bump, bump, release, bump, bump, release, and think about really getting that connection from your left leg to the right rein. That's it, connected and round in the right rein, supple and give on the left, there. Connected in the right rein, yeah, connected in the right rein, good, good, good. Good. Okay, when you're ready, transition up to the trot and just focusing, yeah, you can start on a 20 meter circle in the middle. Focus on steady tempo and steady contact. 
trot, trot. That's right, steady tempo and steady contact. From inner leg to outer rein. That's it, good. Think about your left leg a little more, pushing him outward from your left leg. Yeah, go ahead and go straight ahead. Good, use your left leg to push him straight down the rail. That's right, nice, good. Good, make him trot up to your posting. So like think about landing a little softer in the saddle and maybe just a little quicker the tempo and give him a little kick with your left leg and circle down here. So you saw how he wanted to fall in in the corner and I know that from him that sometimes he likes to go against your inner leg. That's right, inside leg to outside rein. Steady in the outside rein, don't work hard. Give him a little kick, kick, don't work hard. That's right, inside leg to outside rein. Steady in the outside rein. Good, Sylvia. That's better. There you go. Well done. Excellent. Good. If he's behind you, make, make a correction. Don't worry that you're on film, you know. Make the corrections you need to make. Go straight ahead, inside leg, and then circle in the middle. Yes, that's looking better. Good. And 20 meter circle in the middle. Inner leg to outer rein. Use your left leg there. When you feel him go like fall in, fix that from your left leg, not from your left hand going across his neck. Well done. And then straight ahead and circle at the far end. Good, that's getting better. Steady connection into the right rein, keeping him off of your left leg. Good, and then 20 meter circle down there at C. Good. Good, into that outer rein. Well done. Left leg, right rein, super. Good, good, change direction on the diagonal and then we do the same thing to the right. So it's always good to just start out with very simple exercises as you get to know a horse, focusing on that steady tempo and the steady contact. Good, and now you're pushing him off your right leg and into the left rein. That's it. Good, super. Good job. Nice, inner leg to outer rein. If he's behind the leg, you can give him a little kick. He's, yeah, and then take your leg off. Good, and no nagging. So you always start the bend from your inner leg. You kind of think about leg yielding your horse a little off the inside leg. Yeah, so your inner leg pushes his shoulders out, but your outer leg behind the girth keeps the haunches from falling out. Good, and then straight ahead and circle at the far end. Good, good job, well done. Yep, focus on getting him connected from the right leg to the left hand. Good, Sylvia, good. Do one full 20 meter circle and then you're gonna start a three loop serpentine next time around. That's it, good. And don't nag, push your heels down. Yes, try and keep your lower leg still unless you're asking for something. Come on, give him a little kick there. Three loop serpentine. So bending to the right, good. Now push him off your left leg. Think about leg yielding him out towards E. Yes, good. Turning, bending, turn, uh-oh. And now pushing him off of your right leg into the outer rein. Oh gosh, you killed the, you killed the cones. <sighs> That's okay. But so that was a good demonstration of like, the reason a three loop serpentine is a really good thing to practice is because it really focuses on suppleness and getting your horse on the aids, getting your horse steerable, and that's always hard when you're on a new horse is just finding those buttons and figuring out what it takes on a different horse. So it's not a big deal. You just pick up the trot and you try it again. I think it will help if you look, look up and really plan ahead for where you're headed next. Nice trot, Sylvia. Supple and soft on the inside rein. You always, want to test that the bend is correct by being able to soften a little bit your inner rein. Yeah, quieter lower leg. Good, left leg, push him, leg yield him out. 
towards E, supple and give left, turning, bending, turn, 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 turn. Yep, good. Inside leg, push him out. Good job. That's it. Do that one more time, you three loop serpentine. Yes, well done. Yeah, the trot doesn't need to be quicker. It could be a little longer, but not quicker. Good, Sylvia. Hands more together. Use smaller aids. Leg, yield him off your inner leg. Get him to go to B. Flex and be able to soften on the left hand. Flex and give on the left. Good, well done. Nice, super. Good job, supple and soft. Good, that's it. Supple and soft on that inner rein. Good, quiet your lower leg. Good, move him off your left leg into that right rein. Good, supple and soft. Nice, supple and soft. Good, good, push him off the right leg. Good, well done. Good, give him a little short walk break. Good, good, nice. Good job, that was super. Good boy, Mercurio. I hope you enjoyed that video where we gave you a few great exercises to warm up your horse. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up and check out that description box if you would like to download my free mini course on rider position.